Welcome. Wow. Hello. hello. Wow. This is the Novo Convo Podcast. I'm Harrison, and to my other side (laughs) is Veronica. Why did I think for a second? I was like, man, what what if she switches it up? Wait, no. She's not the one doing this. Yeah. I was like, what are you talking about? Yes. What do you mean? But, yeah. Veronica, we just want an excuse to talk about anything that entertains us, but really to clean up our never-ending backlog, and oh my god, we're about to do something today, because we are, but some would say, Veronica, we are conversing. Wow, like Novo Convo and GOVO Convo, Locus of Harrison's head. Right there. Wow. Just, <laughs> it's great. It's great. But you know what is even better is that you can watch every episode on YouTube.com or listen to it as a podcast by searching up Nova Comma on your podcast service of choice. This episode is also sponsored by Olipop, but we will get to that later. This is the Wait. last episode of episode nine, Veronica. Wow, nine. Yes. But the last yes. episode of the Dragon Ball manga review for us. So if you haven't finished, uh, well, I'll... Uh, we're almost done. So you just finish it. Just go do it. But I don't think not many people know about Dragon Ball, so this is really cool for me to like know that you finished this, honestly. Yeah. And it was a really cool recap for me. Um so you haven't read or watched it, we're gonna be talking about manga chapters one sixty two to one ninety four and anime episodes one twenty three to one fifty three. Oh, wow. That's a lot of anime episodes. Yeah. yeah. But it's crazy because the anime actually has something extra that the manga oh. doesn't. And I actually oh, okay. do remember this. And I was like, oh, yeah, that, that's a thing. Uh, we'll talk about that later. Okay. Um, but, again, we at this point, we're this far in. No spoiler. Or we're going to be talking spoilers. There's not going to be any non-spoilers because yeah. let's be real. Yeah. You've all that's, seen it. We've all seen it. Yeah. We're getting this over with. I'm ripping yeah. the band-aid off. Like I've been doing for the last Rip. nine episodes. But um so let's just get this going. Uh because there's this was kind of a lot. Actual kind of a lot, but also not. It felt Yeah. It was a lot, but also not. It's Does this compact. feel like an epilogue to you? In a sense? Yeah, a little bit. A little, a little bit. bit. Yeah. But before that, um the very first thing is we get to where Goku is going to meet God. Yes. Thoughts on that? Because I don't. Did you? Exp- <laughs> did you? Okay. Because the key's doing the powerful expand extend up to the mm-hmm. next area. Yeah. What were your expectations? What you think? I had no expectations. So Mr. Popo was just like. Yeah, yeah. Mr. Popo was just a surprise. <laughs> <laughs> and also, God was a surprise. I had a little inkling, but then I was like, no, nah. I was like, nah. And then they revealed it. I was like, oh, okay. That's interesting. Yeah, right? No, but I um, I figured it would be another training arc for him. So I kind knew of. he was, yeah. yeah. I knew he'd, he'd get his training in. But this one was kind of nice in that. So essentially it's like Goku meets Popo, gets um, humbled. Yes, immediately. Immediately, real because then even Popo's he was like, just like, "You're not good." I think Popo said it right though. He's like, "Oh, you think you defeated King Piccolo and you thought yourself the strongest, yeah, but you forget that could be other stronger." And then Goku's like, "I'm dumb. <laughs> I'm stupid." This is this that. is I, I'm dumb. But yeah, essentially, like, they they were just testing him. Mm-hmm. I like I, how God's just like, let me meet him. And Pope's yeah. like, are you sure? He's like, I like him. Let's, let's meet him. <laughs> let's meet him. <laughs> yeah. I did not realize it was going to be... Uh, I forgot um, how this was going to play out. Like, I thought they would do, like, this whole thing. Mm-hmm. So, I was right. The anime does have him go back in time. Had has goku oh. go back in time to see roshi when he was younger and all that stuff yeah. i was waiting to see if that would happen at all and it didn't so it, it, was, didn't. it was anime only okay. but i figured that was like i forgot how that worked so that's why i was really do you confused. think that flushed out uh roshi at all 
going back in time? It kind of fleshed out Roshi, but it also gave some backstory on the Mafuba technique. Mm. Because you got to okay. see... So definitely that was like filler in like anime only at this point. Yeah. Because I remember okay. seeing that. But I was That's waiting. I was like, okay, well, let me read this part You're again. You're like waiting here sure. to like see it. Yeah. Well, I thought it was going to happen last arc with the king. Oh, that would have been made more that sense. That made more sense, right? And then yeah. here we are here. And I'm like, yeah. Hmm. But comment down below if I'm crazy, but I swear that was a thing. Um, but yeah. Uh, Dragon Balls. <laughs> yeah. Who makes them? Cre- created by God himself. Or should I say Piccolo's like soul or like no split so soul or something yeah it's split soul but i think kami's body is the original body the original because the way right? he explained this is that and it's cool how he like was like oh i was trying to learn martial like you know become like i thought i'd be the next heir and all that stuff yeah yeah he's also a martial arts expert again yeah, i like how that's just like a thing it's consistent. It's consistent. It's like they're right? all wanting to be martial artists. Yeah, everyone wants to do that, right? It's a thing. It's a fad. We're like, yes, let's do it. I want to be that too. I don't want to be oh like my God. an astronaut. What do you mean? <laughs> but yeah, no, they're connected. Did yeah. you expect that? No. I had like a kind of a feeling because Piccolo was really important in the last arc. And then, you know, he threw up his son. <laughs> out in his mouth so i was just like he's got to be there's got to be more to piccolo mm-hmm. than than what i'm seeing right now yeah um but it was a little bit of a surprise i was like oh this is nice to see <laughs> the connections are connecting yeah right but then like essentially goku was once he learns like oh because he, he kind of learns parts of that mm-hmm. but he doesn't fully but- I like how Go- Goku's just like nonchalant about meeting God. Oh, He's like, God. oh, you're just like another person. Like, I'll just train with you. Give me the Dragon Balls back. Yeah. And then I like how they just sped that up. He's like, yep. So we're going to make this. Um, yeah. Usually they're in stone, but we're just going to do this right away. And you can just wish everyone back that was killed by King Piccolo. Yeah. I'm like, oh, that's the loophole. Yeah, really. Because he, he, I remember a line where... Um, God was just like, oh, yeah, just tell the dragon, you know, I told him that he could just give you that wish. <laughs> and it's funny because he, yeah, even he was like, I can't do it, but the dragon can do it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, I may be God, but I can't do that. <laughs> exactly. And it, it was, was cool. cool how to see everything was made. Yeah, it was cool. And it's cool, like, how... Um, his reasoning he's like oh i kind of made dragon balls to give hope but then i noticed that people just keep wishing for bad stuff so i was gonna leave it but you convinced me (laughs) yeah but essentially so friends could revive everyone um and goku stays the train right yep now we hit another time skip a legit one though i feel like it's i feel like this was a legit time skip no Um, it really was because. I could tell because of the height. <laughs> How so? What do you mean? What do you mean? Because he's they... taller. Oh yeah, you're right. No, what's crazy is like I remember he was taller, but mm-hmm. the manga actually puts into perspective how not much taller he is because compared to Z. Yeah. I just forgot that in Z, yes, he's taller and older, but here it's like straight up like he's taller, but he's still shorter than Yamcha and Tien. Yeah, I think it was just like, you know, in the he he's in the middle of the puberty. <laughs> well, here, okay, no, no he no. well he's like seventeen. No, he's like here. eighteen, eighteen, nineteen. Eighteen, oh, he should be eighteen, right? Seventeen, eighteen. He already, because when he's okay, he should have been taller. When he gets up to to Kami, he's already. He was like 15? twelve, fifteen. No, because remember, like, initially in the first tournament, he he forgets that he he's not thirteen; he's twelve or something. Oh. Oh, yeah. And then add 12, three more years, three, right? 15. Okay, he should be 18. Yeah. Yeah, so he's 18 here. Krillin's still short. Krillin is still short. <laughs> he grew, short. but he's still short. But not by much. <laughs> and I pulled this up every time. I like how everyone didn't recognize him. I know. Roshi's like, like, have you seen this kid? <laughs> he's like, do you know who this is? 
Is he your friend? No. <laughs> Takes off his. Oh, I love how he says he has a whole getup too. But. Oh my god, I know. <sighs> so everyone meets each other because y- yada yada. Um, we have another tournament. tournament but the whole arc! so I forgot. I do like how the entire reason Goku trained with God though is because Piccolo Junior is still a thing. So yep. he's training to learn that. Um, I think one thing I want to point out is Goku had to actually finally train his heart and soul. Yeah. Not his, yeah. not even his mind, but like his soul. Yeah. Not his tail, but his soul. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's right. He trained his tail the last time. I forgot. Yeah, the last time. <sighs> How do you want to do the tournament? Because uh, I know, I think each one was really just kind of like a story, like to tie up stuff right to tie yeah to tie up so because like essentially we're just gonna do quarterfinals because there's this there's all these things in between but that's yeah. pretty real it's a lot um quarterfinals mercenary tau still a thing dude that's so crazy and they introduce cyborgs yes not android cyborgs cyborgs right he said cyborg right yeah he's a cyborg yeah crazy how they get that weird going like down the line yeah a little weird um but Tien's stronger yeah no but i figured he would be stronger because he's really competitive yep and when he you know he saw goku just kind of like power up some more i figured Tien would want to be yeah a whole lot stronger yeah everyone yeah. got stronger let's be real yeah That's fine. yeah um oh there was one thing in the preliminaries that I thought was funny. Um, Yajirobe tried to join. Oh. Masked. The mask. But he got that beat by so... Shen. That was. Oh my god. That was I think so that funny. was the funniest thing. I was oh, he did try to join. Oh, that's cool. The other funny thing was um, Chi Chi or the mysterious <gasps> girl. The mysterious girl seeing Goku saying hi and he's yeah. like, who? He's like, what? He's just like, how dare you? I like how he finally figured it out. And then, um, who was it? Krillin was just like, what? You wanted to take her hand? Everyone, well, Krillin the entire time was like, were you actually training? Or how'd you get this girl? How'd you get a hot <laughs> uh. Oh, Krillin. Oh, he's doubting Goku. <laughs> it's true. Did not, did not respect this game. No. <laughs> um, but... Yeah, so Mercy Tao and Tian, that was sorted out real fast. Because even though Tao was like the entire time, he's like, I'm going to beat all of you and you're all going to die. And they're all like, oh, okay. <laughs> they were so chill about it. They're like, okay, whatever. <laughs> I like how everyone's so worried. And Goku's like, nah, he's better. Yeah. He's better. I could tell. I was like, oh, he's scary. <laughs> he's so scary now. <laughs> but speaking of Chi Chi. Goku versus Chi Chi on this one. Or Anonymous Girl who... Anonymous became, Girl. I, I think in the anime, she actually just calls says Anonymous as like the name. Well, like oh. in the... I think so. Yeah, in the manga says Mysterious Girl. Yeah. 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 Who, or Mystery Girl or something. Mystery Girl or who decides yeah. to... Yeah. So. Th- thoughts on that? Her. That was such a cute like reunion. And we ha- and in the manga, you- I haven't seen her since the beginning, really. Yep. And that's so. I feel like the anime probably fleshed her out a little bit better, maybe if you remember. I don't know, but it was just like it was cute. It was just cute to see. There might have been in between, but I don't. But I think it's kind of the same idea where like, oh, Gigi like appeared for the first time. Yeah, yeah. No, but I thought I was- it was really cute because she was I- so mad at him. Yeah. <laughs> I like how Oolong's the only one that remembers. Yeah. And that he's like, it's it's her accent. <laughs> it's her country. It's her hick accent. And I'm like, huh? Oh. And he's like, how can you all not remember this? And he's like, Boma, you've met her. No, even you, Roshi. I was like, it's true. It's true. Facts. Yeah. No, it was really cute. Yeah. And I thought it was really funny because she was like, don't you remember? You asked me to marry you. And everyone's like, what? scandalous Goku's especially like, for goku <laughs> i love how his in his thoughts he's like oh yeah i guess i did say that well a promise yeah. is a promise 
He didn't and, even fight it. He was like, okay. Okay. Sure. <laughs> you stop holding too tight. No, nah, this is what couples do. I was like, yeah. damn, Goku about to learn today. He's no, a fighting really genius, cute. and then it comes to this stuff. He's like, no, no thanks. <laughs> Brain does not compute. I love how Piccolo Jr. is just watching all this from the side, though, as we've talked about all these. As a creep. Huh? As a creep. <laughs> He's just chilling up top. And no one says chilling. anything. No one's no. like. No. Because you could see him. The stadium's not that big. Everyone's probably like, what's that dude doing here? But now it's Krillin's turn alien? to fight. And he fights Junior. Intense fight. Intense fight. And I like how it showcases how much Krillin's also grown. Yes. Not in height, but in talent. <laughs> Damn, bro. Can't. Eat. Yeah, you're right, though. <laughs> yeah. But, like, he it shows how much he's grown because there's always a moment. I think it was probably yeah. really cool where it looks like he's like, oh, this is where he would lose. But he didn't. But he doesn't. No, I thought it was really cool. He pulls out so many moves, too. A little too much. Can we talk about I how... like... Oh, wait, we're Oh, no, no, it. no. Yeah, go. Go for it. No, I was just going to say, like, I like how Krillin, like, I could hear him, like, yelling, like, at Goku and be like, watch me. <laughs> I've been training, too. I. It's cool how they all actually did go, um, go to, uh, Corrin's, uh, mm-hmm. lookout. Yeah. To train. Because they also met Riyadh Robi. But they all went up there and then, like, went their separate ways, which I think is cool. Yeah, that was really cool. I thought yeah. that was really cool. Uh, favorite part on this fight? For Krillin? Yeah. I just I like his... One, but... I, I just like how he progresses in every tournament. And this one was, like, the last one. And so I did enjoy that he went against Piccolo Jr. And he just fought his way through. Yeah, and then Pickle Jr. slowly gaining respect as in like, oh no, this is not going to yeah. be as easy as I thought. Yeah, exactly. I like how, so this is a cool moment where I forgot how flying, again, drag, my first introduction was Dragon Ball Z, but then I did go back and watch Dragon mm-hmm. Ball. back? Okay. And I forgot that flying really was just the jutsu, like bo- Boken Jutsu, I think it was called. Yeah. I forgot it was. But they just started saying, he could do it. And I'm like, that's why they all can fly at that point. Oh. But they just you had that realization. Too. Well, because here I felt more like, oh, they can float or stop themselves. Yeah, or like stop right? themselves. Which yeah. is probably more accurate for martial arts. Dragon Ball Z just took it to, all right, now they can just fly. You you could just fly. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so Krillin loses or he uh, forfeits. Yes. Then, yeah. So now Piccolo moves on. And now we have Yamcha versus Shen. Who is Shen? I don't know. Thoughts on this one? <laughs> Yamcha was just like, he looks like a normal guy. I can beat him up. Because he does look like a normal guy. Yeah, he does. He does. But I like how Yamcha, like, I think the funniest thing for me was Yamcha, like, flying. And then the dude, like, ducks, but then he hits his head. Yep. On his, like, on his... Yep. No, no square. Yeah. <laughs> the no, no square. I was just like, ooh, that's got to hurt. Yeah. <sighs> but no, that was a good fight. Yamcha has definitely grown too. Also grown. Because I think the coolest yeah. part was he was actually able to use like a spirit ball attack. Yeah. Where he like yeah. creates the ball and then like controls it. He just kind of controls it. Man, that. Because they pulled all these moves, and it's funny because I remember all these moves because of the fighting games, the Dragon Ball fighting, Dragon Ball Z fighting games. But it's like, I see him do all this stuff, and at the time I was like, I don't remember seeing this in Z. Oh, I see. It's all from here. Yeah, a lot of their stuff is coming from here. So I was like, oh. Wait, that's actually really funny. Yeah. See, as a kid, you wouldn't know this stuff. But you're just like, this is so cool. Yeah. yeah. (sighs) But. Yamcha gets knocked out because he actually like had to take it serious. But then Shen, who's Shen though? I don't know. Shen is just God, I guess. You didn't read the book? Oh, oh. No. oh. damn. I okay. did. Damn. Okay, let me. All right. So 
Shen moves on. Yamcha's out. Oof. Now, uh, I'm trying to think how fast we're going to go with this. You know what? To be safe. Because these could be long. I'm going to claim this break real quick. So we're going to take a quick minute or so to talk about our sponsor. This episode is sponsored by Olipop, the soda your gut will thank you for. Yes, talking to you, all of you. <laughs> all right, have you ever missed that classic soda pop feeling? You know, the fizz, the flavor, but without the sugar crash and the guilt trip. Yeah, me too, me too, me too, you too, Harrison too. <laughs> all of us. That's why I'm introducing to you Olipop, the soda that's bursting with flavor and good for you too. I actually have my favorite one here, strawberry vanilla. But the other weird one that I enjoyed was banana cream. I know it's weird, super weird, but this is my favorite. Number one, because it only has three grams of sugar per can, plus it has nine grams of prebiotic fiber. And you know what you need with fiber? To use the restroom. <laughs> He he he. But yeah, that means that you're going to have a happy and healthy gut with every sip. And it looks like that they took everything we loved about classic soda and upgraded to a modern, healthy, conscience person. Like you, like me, like Harrison, my co-partner, my co-host that's not here right now. So ditch the compromise and experience the soda revolution for yourself. Don't forget to use our promo code NOVO15 NGO. VO15 to get 15% off your first order on drinkolipop.com. All right, and we're back. Wow. What a quick what a quick break to drink some coffee Ugh. or Olipop. Got me thirsty. <laughs> All right. Uh semifinals. Goku versus Tien. I think this was probably like one of the hype fights that we were waiting for. I think for so too. Yeah. Because rematch basically and they're both stronger now so i was both like how are they stronger. going to get get this going honestly no, it, was, it, it was fun because they're friends now yeah yeah so yeah. now they're like it's kind of like legit fighting like it's actually like a rival fighting mm -hmm. or friendly rival friendly rivalry match there you go yeah friendlies and i like how roshi's actually watching this this time oh Good point. I like how Roshi's actually watching and also admitting that he's like outclassed he's, at this he's point. Old. Yeah. But like everyone outclasses him. Yeah. And I think that was a cool measure because they, I think that was where it was done really well. Where first tournament, first two actually that we see mm -hmm. sets Roshi the bar. Into it. Yeah. Yeah. Or should I say Jackie Chun? Jackie Chun has retired. <laughs> he's retired. There was a lot going on in this fight, though. Like, they all pulled out so many crazy, crazy moves. They, like, went went into it. Mm -hmm. It was crazy. I was proud of Tien, though. Yeah. I'm happy for him. Yeah. But also, Goku just being Goku now. He's like... I still... Two things I think was cool was the reveal and, like, how much weight he's yeah. actually wearing. When I read that, I was like, oh, this reminds me of Naruto. <laughs> Which I was like, is this where Naruto got? Is this idea? This is where I truly believe this is where I pulled it from. It was just yeah. everyone thinks of Naruto because it was more impactful. Yes. The Rock Lee re the You're Rock talking Lee. about the Rock Lee thing, yeah. right? Yeah. That's, yeah, yeah. Again, that's crazy. But the weight training, I'm pretty sure he took from this. He, yeah. Or he like, mean, saw he's like, dang, that's cool. He probably was like, this is so cool. I'm going to use it. Yeah, it is cool um because no, yeah. the reaction yeah. from everyone though with the weights they were so ha even tien was like no <laughs> tien he like was trying like, to lift one <laughs> tien being like you didn't get that much strong you, you got you can see everything but the one thing you're lacking is speed goku hold on a second <laughs> <laughs> he's like i forgot i, I <laughs> took that personally <laughs> <laughs> and i like how goku's just like i'm light on my feet now and i like how shen or kami's like yeah, because Shine is Kami, right? So yeah, Kami Shine, was like, yeah. ah, he thinks this guy's worth it. All right, cool. <laughs> <laughs> Essentially. No, basically. No, it was really cool. 
and then Tien show because they all do these moves, but I forgot that Tien can do the four body move. Mm hmm. Yeah. I did not expect the weaknesses though. What do you mean? No, no, legitimately, I didn't like, think about it. Like, I was like, oh, oh yeah. yeah. Well, duh, it's like, oh, weakness one. I'm going to blind you now. <laughs> I'm like, oh. Because it was like it's a such legitimate. It's like an easy concept, too. Yeah, but it was like yeah. a legitimate combo that would freak a normal person out, though, right? It's oh, like, oh, yeah. there's four yeah. people in a corner and it's about to blast them. It's, yeah. Kind of like a blind side. Because he's like forcing you to move up and he's like, all right, blind. And then two. I like how he's like, I like Goku who's like, Tien, cool move, but kind of dumb. <laughs> I was like, what? Splits your Goku. strength. Yeah. I was like, oh, dang, he's right, I guess. Holy shit. Okay. Goku's like, I'm smart now. <laughs> no, and then I think that's when Roshi was like, this guy's a genius. <laughs> yeah. I true. like how Roshi's just like, I'm going to take credit, some credit. <laughs> He's using his brain. Um, and then, but essentially, Tian loses. Mm-hmm. I and I do like. Did you notice how consistently they've been pointing out, like, oh, Goku hasn't lost his breath. Goku is yes. like not tired. Yeah. And I'm like, that's again cool. As like a for Dragon Ball. This is like the peak, right? This is like, oh, look, yeah. this is how far they've come. This is really cool. Like, established. And I like how it's at the end, too. Mm hmm Yeah. Like, they're tying up They're tying up all the stories that we've seen along the way. So. Mm hmm Now, Shen versus Junior. Thoughts what on this interesting one? interesting combo. I thought, like, Piccolo Junior would kind of, like, sniff out kami i don't know you know like yeah you know the connection didn't. like yeah, he, yeah, but yeah. he didn't but so he didn't. i figured at the beginning before like finishing up this fight i was like oh he's going to like piccolo jr's gonna like sniff out basically his dad's like soul <laughs> you yeah. would think you know yeah i don't know like aliens he yeah, i don't know but it was interesting because like kami was just like oh god i gotta fight i gotta fight my kid <laughs> basically yeah no but it was, I like, a, it was intense yeah i do like how the the because piccolo was noticing like oh his fighting style is like similar yeah. to ours that's yeah. weird like the quote-unquote demon people um i think the coolest thing was like they reveal like <clears throat> they can hear each other mentally yes which then they that's when so I had to, I didn't catch that initially. I was like, okay, that's a thought bubble. But then when they started talking, they showed the alien. It was like the alien yeah. language. Yep. Or you know a different language. I was Easy. I thought that was a cool I thought that was a cool detail. No, I thought that was really cool. Yeah. And you know when you're reading, it's just like oh, someone's talking, or like someone's thought bubbles. But mm -hmm. I like how he distinguished the alien language and like they could both understand it, mm -hmm. their thoughts. So yeah, that was really cool to see. Yeah, 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 yeah. But I also forgot that Kami was going to use the e um, evil containment wave on yeah. Makuba. Yep. Did you expect Piccolo to counter that? No, not at all. I didn't know there was a counter at all. Yeah. Right? <laughs> but they really established that P Piccolo Jr. is like actually really strong. strong. Or actually did his homework legitimately. <laughs> He's like, this version ain't going to lose to anything. Yeah, nothing's getting in my way. Yeah. So he seals. But I'm happy. I'm happy the normal guy is alive. Yes. He is a, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's another thing. That was interesting because technically. Yeah, that. That was interesting that I didn't, I couldn't remember if that's how that worked, like the soul specifically. Like the soul, yeah. Because, again, we didn't really, we weren't aware of how that worked for um, King Piccolo because it didn't work second yeah, time. Yeah, it didn't work, yeah. Uh, I like how they both just can do it so well, like Piccolo just like, okay, into the, into the li and it's like a little bottle too. Yeah, yeah. So the target is even smaller than a... 
rice cooker. rice cooker. Yeah, the rice cooker. <laughs> it was like a little jar. Yeah. But yeah, for the guy, yeah, so in the jar and then the dude's alive but sees his son. And like, even his son went. I was like, whoa. It's crazy. Okay, that's weird, but cool. I'll go with it. The kid's like, wow, dad, you're really strong. You made it in like, the top four. I'm like, unfortunately, he's set up for a life in the worst way. <laughs> yeah. Because he's going to be like, what are you talking about? I don't remember anything. Yeah. <sighs> but Piccolo swallows the bottle. Ooh, it's kind of nasty. And then, but then now I like how everyone knows, like, even um, Roshi was like, okay, Goku, spill it. What's going yeah. on? Because then they're all like, that's Piccolo, right? And then, yeah, they had to give the whole backstory and all that. Yeah, the whole backstory. I do thoughts on like how actually the reason why Kami fought is because he they can't kill Piccolo, right? No, yeah. Well, I mean, if he if Piccolo is dead, then Kami's technically yep. dead too, yep. and vice versa. Yep. So it's like they're connected, which is actually crazy sense. when you think about it. In that, um, Kami technically got lucky that the mm-hmm. last time because he didn't intervene, that the yeah. last time King Piccolo just happened to be contained yep because if he if they killed him then at that point kami would have died too then dragon ball wouldn't have existed yeah yeah <laughs> and yeah we'll talk about that <laughs> she's catching on oh my god i'm catching on it's just fights and dragon balls wow yeah <laughs> and then reset and that's it all right i want your thoughts i want your entire thoughts on the final fight on Goku versus Piccolo. Extremely hear? intense. I thought the Piccolo versus, like, um, in the last arc was an intense fight. But then I read, the, like, the Piccolo Jr. versus Goku. And I was just like, oh, this is even, like, crazier, nastier. You could tell that Toriyama's um, getting better about drawing and yeah. draw- essentially creating the fights. Yeah. Hence why like people, setting it up. And yeah, like, setting it up. Yeah. And then like the framing and like, yeah. The pacing. And I also too. thought it was really cool that Goku was extremely calm this tournament. It was just like, yeah, you know, he was just cool about it. And especially here, because this was like the technically top two. Um, no, but yeah, it was really cool to see everything. Yeah. I will say this was the moment that reminded me of Z and that oh. the, and <laughs> it's literally the let's go help him. And here's the thing. Now this establishes the the joke in that we have to do one on ones. Yes. And you can't just beat him like you can't just like do it wrong. Cause again, here I think they explain it better where it's the martial arts spirit of trying to defeat your opponent 1v1 like 1v1 yeah on your own yes and goku has that stubbornness about it he's like oh because remember i think at one point okay i think this is the coolest thing and it's also interesting because um it's the part where goku piccolo can grow himself yeah into a giant again all these moves even like just knowing z Watching Dra- like reading this part of Dragon Ball, I was mm-hmm. surprised because I, he's never done this. I no. don't remember him growing big. He uh, did not grow big. Like Piccolo did not grow big. So Junior just did. Yeah, and I think they might have alluded to it that he could, but he like just he never could. did it, right? Yeah, I don't yeah. Think so. Not like visually not to that, for us, and also not that to that height. No, it was but I like how at that moment, Goku's like, "All right, it's big enough." Jumps in like. Goes yeah. into his mouth, gets the bottle. <laughs> I was like, dang. What a this loophole. This is a plan. <laughs> what a loophole. But yeah, I like it. So going back to the thing where I think it's cool. Like Kami was like, okay, we can take him. We can take him off. And Goku's yeah. like, no. The entire time. <laughs> Me. I'll but take him off. It's funny because then everyone else kind of respects it at that point. They're like, mm-hmm. we understand where he's coming from. And it's also like. We can't do anything about it. Well, they've known him for so long. That's yeah. why they didn't stop him or yeah. like want to like. But ma- like match this was the, him. yeah. But this was like the 
Dragon Ball Z like moment where I was like, yeah, this is why it continues <laughs> to be like that forever. This is the moment. No, or this is I the can fight. see it. Yeah, because yeah. I actually did finish Dragon Ball Z. Yeah, we'll talk about that in a bit. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> um, but Goku wins, and Kami was about to kill him. Yeah. Yeah. Was there any other fights or uh, any other moment in this fight that you liked before I? I. What I liked was the kind of like the air fighting because I think I think that improved a lot from the last. Uh, mm-hmm. tournament mm-hmm. so th- it was really cool to see the panels in the air for this yeah. one yeah um it was just really interesting to see like i guess the group at the bottom <laughs> or should i say underground because at some point tn like made sure they were underground yes like in the ground yeah to be safe okay i didn't expect them to do use that move <laughs> yeah. in that sense and i'm like wait that makes oh duh that makes total sense That's <laughs> valid okay <laughs> And I love how Chi Chi is just like, that's my man. She's Sorry. going along with this. And oh yeah. Oh, I didn't even I didn't even notice that. She did that? Hard eyes? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Oh. Pretty sure there were hard eyes. Oh, I need to check that. I'm yeah, pretty sure. But it was like so funny because she's like she's like, I'm gonna marry him. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, and the amount of another thing that wowed me. Goku using Kamehameha with his feet yeah because that's never done ever again no and it wows me that that's never done ever again no it's crazy like how they're using the moves here is honestly way cooler this is where i think i had more fun watching dragon or reading dragon ball than z where Mm. the moves felt like they were used in a unique way at times like it felt like a fluid way and very fluid yes yeah like i at first i thought that was like a when he showed like him going on the Kamehameha, I was like, did he do it and then jump on it? Or I was like, how'd that work? And then yeah. they all said, they're like, he used his feet. And I'm like, okay, yeah. that's even crazy. <laughs> that's crazier. Yeah. But I think there's a lot of cool moves that they did. Like, it was like, it was just back to back. It felt like it was like yeah. an actual like move here, kind of here, move here, kind of here. All right, I'm going to do it. I was like, it felt like a fight versus just like in this this is where I'm going to do my critique in that. I think this is where Dragon Ball Z, like the fighting is, can be better. But at times it is just like, oh, they're moving so fast. Yeah. Panel wise and animation wise. It's just a boop, 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 boop. Right, right. No, yeah, no, I totally agree. Yeah. <sighs> but Junior's not dead. No, because Goku has a heart and said, and said, no, nah. kill him. No. Nah. Can you. <gasps> Can you believe that Goku denied godhood? Yeah. <laughs> yes, I can. It's boring up there. Yeah, he's like, no thanks. I'm pretty sure he's thinking about Mr. Popo too. How humbling that experience can be. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> Mr. Popo's training. Oh, God. <sighs> okay, I do want to add that. So that is the end of. That's essentially the end, right? Yeah, that's like, the end. Goku's going to get married. Chi Chi and Goku getting married. So that's the thing, though. So in the anime, they actually had a whole sequence after that dealt oh. with the wedding. Like the ceremony? Okay, the wedding. Yeah, like yeah. he had to go get like something. He had to go do this trial thing because he gets to see his grandpa again one more time. Mm, okay. But in the afterlife. So that's the whole thing. So that's why I was like, I really kind of want to watch Dragon Ball yeah just to just to like because again anything. it's only 150 it's only 150 episodes wow wow only huh. i feel like they like flushed um chi chi and goku out and their wedding out a lot better in the anime that's what it sounds like because here it was so abrupt like the it's uh, it's still fillery but yes it does add yeah. context yes it does like for dragon ball i think this is when i think fillers actually did help the um, story itself overall yeah so in the manga it's just like fighting ends goku yes. goku just takes chi chi and they just fly away yeah so i think now that we're done overall yeah how was it i thoroughly enjoyed it i'm so because i was so because everyone including you all our friends were like you may or may not enjoy this 
it's in it a is, sense it's the thing if you were you made a point though in the first early episodes where it felt dated all the jokes yeah dated and you're right but it's also but they, like, weird they, they cooled it down they cooled it down but they kept it yeah. going right yeah. yeah like yes roshi's still grabbing the butt like nowadays yes that'd be bad but it's weird because at the time i still can see it as like a man's a perv yes yeah man, but man's just a perv man's just a perv but not creep but also creep you know what i mean yeah it's like, yeah it's it was fun to see your reactions to all this but now it's like ironically it's like i get it right yeah it's it's pretty bad now if you like if he yeah. was to make you know make dragon ball yeah. now hence why all shonen don't really do that no mm-mm they learned their lesson that, again like i know people are like oh I, and that's the other thing i what i miss and i now get it even more so all these characters are built up so well yes just to get sidelined so hard in z and beyond oh, actually yeah and beyond, all right problem and that's my segue this one who you <laughs> you said it earlier you finished z Yes, I did. That was that was pretty good too. And I'm like, at first I was like, oh, like you're on like what, like finishing Saiyan Saga? You're probably on Namek Saga. You're like, no, I'm done. I'm done, done. I was like, wait. I was just like, oh, it's only 325 chapters. It's just Dressrosa. Yeah, it's just Dressrosa. No, I thought Dragon Ball Z was like a really interesting read. Um, but you are right. All these side characters got sidelined. And it's funny because people's exposure is probably only to Z. So to them, they are just side characters. Yeah. But it's like, if you, but it's. Comparing it to Dragon Ball, they were not like, they, they were, were like, legit rivals in like. Rivals. Yeah. Like Goku actually like. Had trouble like Tien was actually a rival for two tournaments. Yeah. Right. Krillin and, was his friend, also rival. But he shows how strong Krillin re- really is, though, in this part. Yeah. But. And I think Z is just where it's like, okay, now we have different like now there's the Super Saiyan. Oh yeah, now you get introduced to all that stuff. And, yeah. Dude, that's and it was just like it was a lot of fights. Yeah a lot of fights i think th- but that's the thing though i think that's what people like from dragon ball by the end was oh the fighting is what yeah. we care about yeah like initially he was trying to make a journey to the west type deal and it was cool but i think i also started enjoying like seeing goku like get better with fighting and all that right so yeah no i totally agree yeah but yeah i did finish dragon ball z i am now watching dragon ball z oh, or you dragon watch- ball kai Okay. I think you recommended that. I did. I only recommended that because I felt like Z. So I like the music in the OG run more. Mm-hmm. But one, I don't know how that's handled still because there's a lot of contention. Uh, there's yeah. some drama. If you re- look into it, there's drama. I, I did. There was yeah, a lot there's of drama. a lot of drama. <laughs> but I like that music more than Kai. But I think Kai gets to the point faster. From what I've they seen. They definitely do. Because <laughs> I feel like they toned out. They, I think they cut out a lot of like extra time and maybe filler. So. Yeah. It, it's basically like a speed run. And I was going to ask you because you just read it. So you watching it. It does feel like more it's matching the manga in a sense. Yeah. Yeah. It's more one to one for know. like anime to manga. That's good. They did, they did speed up a lot of stuff. I used to be Pierce and be like, no, but you got to watch the OG one because you got to experience all the stuff. Then. The more, as time goes on, you're like, there's a reason why there's a stigma on them just screaming. But yeah. yeah. <laughs> anyway, this should be a whole nother episode because I want your thoughts on that too. Like, oh, okay. Yeah. It could be another episode. Yes. Because I can, yeah. I just wanted to. But for now, it's a Dragon Ball. I'm glad you like it. I was kind of worried. No, I know. Because again, from the beginning though, you're like, you were like, kind of like, this is kind of like, what is this? Like, this is kind of, what is, you were so focused on like, certain I know, things and jokes. I, but but i was just like not wrong though because if you read up on it a lot of people were like he is still coming from his old manga oh, his where old it was manga. more comedic yeah 
and he's like flushed into this. So no, he flushed out pretty well. Yeah, I'm a fan. Yeah, <laughs> rip. But yeah, I, I also see you know why all the other shonens now get all their ideas. <laughs> and they just improved the idea, like like we said, like the whole weight training thing. Like yeah, then we, you see Rock Lee do it, and you're like, oh, that scene is so cool. Like yeah, that scene no, is it insane. Really is. That's aura. Truly. <laughs> well, I'm glad you like it. Um, I'm surprised you kept going. Honestly, I was not. I want to put it on record. I wasn't going to have her read Z or watch Z. No, he wasn't. I re- There was no plan for that. I was like, this is it. <laughs> the end. <laughs> I didn't expect her to finish it. Here I am. Yeah, here you are. Now you can join me and read Super. <laughs> okay. Okay. Wait, no. Do you know about Super? No, yeah. Okay, cool. Well, I haven't have read it. Yeah. That's the part that I was going to start rereading again because I started it because there is the anime, but I think I heard the manga does it a little bit better. Hilariously. Okay. That's funny. Yeah, the anime came out first. And oh, then, and, then he, and then they wrote. And then they start because they ha- it's a different mangaka now. Or his yeah, oh, successor. Yeah. His, uh, but successor. I think he's going to okay. clean up Z, or he's going to wrap up super soon, too. Oh. But I don't know. We'll see. Interesting. Anyway, that's, again, all these could be for later. Do you have anything else you want to add? No, nothing. All right. Then nothing I'm else. just going to wrap this up because this is a lot. I'm impressed. I'm, I'm impressed and happy for you. Congrats. Good yes, job. yes. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in, everyone. Thanks for following us on this. I. This is a lot. It's my excuse to just really get veronica to go on it now now i have the excuse to finally just talk about topical stuff and she can let me go right wow yeah because <laughs> anyway you can follow us on all our socials at nova combo and Yu-Gi-Oh! combo if you're on youtube comment down below let us know what you think let me go i'm tired of reading i'm done how dare you <laughs> <laughs> veronica can't say anything right now i'm taking my taking advantage how dare you? <laughs> That's right. But yeah, uh, like the video. Um, subscribe. Hit all the buttons from right to left. That's really all I care about. Right to left. Yes. Yep. Right to left. Uh, like, yeah. Just end it. I'm done. Bye-bye. Goodbye. 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 <laughs>